Okay, we're all on. Hi everybody. Um, welcome to our, our virtual session of chair yoga for the Ark of Katy. Um, I've been at home thinking of you all and miss each and every one of you. Um, this morning in our class we have Miss Therese. Find Therese, where is she? <laughs> We've got Rosanna, Sandy, and Rhonda. Good morning. So go ahead, if you don't have a chair out already, go ahead and pause the video, get a chair, get a chair for you and your family members. And we're gonna go ahead and just start seated. And this could be your kitchen chair, your dining room chair, your desk chair, whatever you have that's comfortable. And just start seated, feet flat on the floor, hands on the knees, sit up as tall as you can. We're just gonna start out like we always do with our neck. So go ahead and start by dropping your chin to your chest and look toward your belly. Just stretching the back of the neck. Take your deep, full breaths in and out through the nose. If you wanna take it a little deeper, you can interlace your hands behind your head, just putting a little pressure. Take another big inhale and go ahead and lift the head and just look up to the sky and just open the elbows. If your hands are by your uh, hands are on your knees, just look up. Breathing deeply through the front of the neck, stretching the front of the neck. Good, and then come back to center. And then when you're ready, go ahead and just look to one side, stretching the side of the neck. Breathing deeply. and come through center and look to the other shoulder. Good, and then go ahead and come back to center. And then just drop one ear to one shoulder. And you can hang out here if you want to take it deeper. Just put one hand on the head, putting a little pressure there. And if you want to take it even deeper, place the hand on the other shoulder. And just open it up a little, without force. Breathing deeply. Good. Exhaling, come back to center. And then continuing on our neck and shoulders, we're going to just breathe in and bring our shoulders up to our ears. And as you exhale, shrug it down. And we'll do that two more times. Breathing in, bring those shoulders up. Breathing out, shrug them down. And then last time, inhaling and then exhale. Good. We're going to go ahead and interlace our hands in front of us, extending those arms out. And then when you're ready, reverse the hands and extend all the way up, continuing to sit tall. Keep the shoulders down, extend through the spine, press through the hands and breathe deeply. One more breath here, and as you exhale, lower halfway. Again, pressing through the hands, breathing through the upper back, just stretching and relaxing. Good. Exhale, release. And then continuing on with our hands and wrists, go ahead and extend your hand out, and, and as if you were saying stop, and then just gently tug the fingers back. Again, getting a nice forearm stretch. Breathing, relaxing. Good. And then exhale, tug those fingers down. Gentle stretch on the wrist. Good. Exhale, release. And then going to the opposite side, extend your arm out. Gently tug the, fing tug the fingers back. Breathing. And then exhaling, bring those fingers down, stretching through the wrist. Now 
And then as you're ready, extend one arm out to the side and then just reach it up and over, grabbing that opposite shoulder, coming into our cow face arms. And you guys can stay here. If you wanna go a little deeper, you can take the hand and just gently press down, going a little deeper. Again, this is really good for the swimmers in the group. It helps the upper back and shoulders. Breathe deeply. Good. Take one more breath and then exhale, release. Good, extending the other arm out to the side, reaching up and over, grab that opposite shoulder. And again, you can stay here or reach up and over. more breath, exhaling, release. And again, another shoulder one. We're gonna inhale, open those arms wide. And as you exhale, go ahead and cross the elbows under each other. And you know, we have two variations. The first one's the bear hug, if your shoulders are really tight. If you're up for it, you can do eagle arms by bringing the backs or fronts of the hands together. Once you get into your place, wherever you are, lift them up gently and then gently tug away from the body. So you'll feel that in your upper back. Just take your deep breaths, continue breathing and relaxing. Good, one more breath here, exhale. Sweep the arms out, give it a nice stretch and let's bring the opposite arm under. So again, you can come straight into your bear hug or you can do your eagle arms, backs or fronts of the hands together, lift up and gently away from the body. Breathe deeply. Good, one more breath here, exhaling, release. And again, keep the hands on the knees. We're gonna go right into our cat and cow pose. So as we breathe in, we're gonna lift our heart, look up at the sky. And as we breathe out, we're gonna round the spine, draw the belly in and look toward the belly. We'll do that two more times. Breathing in, open up, look up to the sky. Breathing out, round it down. One more inhale, looking all the way up. And one more exhale, bringing it all the way down. And then go ahead and sit up nice and tall. And again, we're gonna work a little on our hips. Um, so you can do a couple variations. You can cross at the ankle, or if you can, bring the ankle all the way up to the knee and you're sitting cross-legged, you're gonna feel that in your right hip and sit up very tall, and that may be enough for you. You can stay here. If you feel like you wanna hinge forward a little bit, you can do that. So deepening that stretch in the right hip. Just breathe here. More breath, come all the way up, release that leg, and then switch sides. So again, you could be crossing at the ankle or bringing the ankle all the way up, squaring it, sitting up tall, and then as you're ready, hinge forward. One more breath here, and then sit up nice and tall. So this is gonna be just a shorter video today. We're not gonna be able to get into some of the other things we do at, at camp. You might remember uh, we do our twists. We, we can stand behind the chair. This is just to give you a little bit of uh, uh, something to do while you're at home, something to help you um, stay busy, stay relaxed. Um, you can do it like we're doing it at the park, as long as you're staying six feet apart from each other. You can do it in your living room. You can do it on your back patio. These are just a few more tools. So we'll end with a very short final relaxation like we usually do. And you can stay seated, you can kind of slump down, you can lay on the ground. Stacy always likes to rest on the back of the chair. Wherever you're comfortable, do that. Just kind of close your eyes and kind of for us, we're gonna feel the breeze, listen to the birds. And wherever you are, just relax deeply. Again, just relax the muscles of your eyes, relax the forehead. Clench the jaw. Just soften the tongue if it's pressing against the roof of your mouth. Just feel your shoulders soften and relax. Your neck is soft and relax. And just send that feeling all the way down the muscles of the body. So belly falls into the spine. Hips are soft and open. And you relax the muscles all the way down the legs. Quads, hamstrings, knees, shins 
calves, ankles, and feet. And just keep relaxing, letting go of all stress, all tension, any anxiety, worry, or fear. Gently just bring awareness back into your body. Wiggle your fingers or your toes. Open your eyes, sit up tall again. And bring your hands to heart center and we'll end by saying namaste. You wanna say a personal message? Oh, thank you everyone for doing yoga with me. I miss you so much. I think about you every single day and I cannot wait to see you and give you a real hug. But for now, here's a virtual hug. <laughs> <laughs> Hi everybody, missing y'all. Hope you're well and families are safe and just keep on moving. Walk around the house if you have to. Um, just keep moving your muscles. Look forward to seeing you and be strong. Hello my friends. Um, I miss you so much. I go into the ark and it's so quiet and it's depressing. I love the joyful noise that you bring and the love that you bring and I miss it every single day. Stay healthy, stay away from each other, and talk on the phone, talk on FaceTime, stay connected with your friends, and know that you are so missed and so loved. Hello, ARC friends. I'm so happy to see all of you. I look forward to the summer program, and also keep in mind, keep moving, stay alert, and pray. Hi, ARC friends. I think about you every day, too, um, and Stay connected with your friends, uh, love your family, pray, and we'll look forward to seeing you when we can all hug again. Take care. <laughs>